This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what? in three seasons. Feels good to be back in a new location we've gotten a couple years ago here in Bel Air in Hartford County and the Hartford Community <laughs> building here and today we have the Sea Conference Championship game the 2C Key School. The Sags at a racket of 12 and 6. And Crystal Ray the top seeded team. Racket of 18 and 10. The Hornets <clears throat> and Sags have met twice in the past week to get makeup games in both games won by Crystal Ray. Mike eventually as the Hornets get it first. Osfar swings it over to Smith. Now the drive. Here comes Key. Back the other way. And side off the class and in. That was a nice play to start off. Key the defending champion. Of Fuso, the senior. These two teams met a year ago in this building, and Key was able to get it done. Crystal Ray trying to see that first C Conference championship. Inside the left, did not go. And the ball's going to stay with Crystal Ray. Key is the two time defending C Conference champion. I have loved this building out here off Community College. Shot clock at 24. About a minute into this one. Comes back. 
Smith at the top of the key. Blocks. Little Vives pull up jumper there by Christian Cassetta. And here comes Key. Loss is footing. And a jump ball at center court. A jump ball right at the top of the key. And the ball is going to go. And it's going to stay with Key on their end. How both teams got to this game. Semi-finals of the C Conference. Crystal Ray defeating Paul. Key defeating Bastillon to get here. To get back here for both of these teams, that is. That kick back. Swings up. Blocked there. And here comes the Hornets. Back the other way. That's a layup. That's two. And we're tied at two. Uh, tied at two here. C Conference Championship game. And stolen back. Ball. Got it in there. 4 2 game for Crystal Ray out of Baltimore City. Again, Eastern and Manchester State. Back over the defense for Lipton. I think Coach Fred and Fisher said that was going to be. That three goes. Marcuso, that's all five points for key so far. And the Zags is up by one. Five thirty-four left in the quarter. Jumper. Got one high. Tipped and missed there for Holiday. Offensive rebound. Oh, off the foot. Nice defense by Key. Key in their road blue jerseys will get it back. It's a 5 4 affair. In this game, only three sophomores on both teams' roster. Very button laden team. And Crystal Ray and Key Hat. Crystal Ray's the top seed in their white uniform. Inside the outlet. Foul on the ground as Uggy Irving. Shot will not count and the ball will be in by the first team foul against the Hornets. Back over. Nice pass. Blocked away. Holiday. But it got right back. That's a three open. That one tipped and missed. And the rebound over to Terry Curry. And Curry swings it back over to Smith. Smith brings it up. Top seed, Crystal Ray down by one. Pass is broken up. And the ball is going to stick and stay with the Hornets. Let's go, deep. Over to Holiday. Back over to Smith. Smith drives, swings, that's a three, front end miss, and the rebound over to the Zags, Tance, double, inside of Smith, that's a three, tipped and missed there by Fuso, offensive rebound blocked inside, and Alder Irving, the junior, is coming to the line to shoot you. This one and then this towel against St. Paul's and St. Francis and now St. Joseph's. Keeping these three games today that the higher seed has won the first two meetings of the season. You know, they say it's hard to beat a team three times in one year. In any sport, we're going to see here how that holds up today. You know, in the IAMs last week on the girls' side, the high seeds is in trouble. They didn't win. 7-4 game for Key right now. Three-point lead for the Zags. The two-time defending C conference champions in the NIA. Swings back. Up and over. Lee in the game. And that's the tie. Turnover. And the ball back. The ball going back to Key. Nice pass 
nice work there. Goes Brent Coleman talking to him before the game. And finally it goes in for Russo. Russo, amazing quarter so far. That's seven of the nine points you see on the board for Keith. 332 left. That's a three from Holiday. Tip and miss. Rebound back over. Swings it up. Spin move. Look, this on the side. Harvey Irving and a timeout by the Tuxedo Hornets. Right now, Crystal Ray with 319 left. Down 11 of 4. And in the two regular seating meetings, this is what Crystal Ray was doing. Crystal Ray was doing this to Key. And maybe in the championship pressure today. It's kind of hurting the Hornets at the moment. 319 here left in the quarter. We want to thank you. Showing us here. We won our AA championship. We won the dash when they got there. They haven't been here in about three years. Last time we was here, I believe it was, it was at Towson. No, it was at UNBC. UNBC. That's how we feel. So, see what Crystal Ray has out the timeout. First game of three here today on the Dice Winning Network. Championship Monday. I we'll had this one in. I had to wish the B Conference Championship game with Bristol, St. Paul. And then the big one, the A Conference game, St. Francis, Mount St. Joe's, that rivalry. Another chapter in it today. Right now for Crystal Ray, trying to get some offense going here as Smith doubled, pressured hard. And Fur had to get that ball out of his hands. Lee swings back over, jumper, got it. Nice adjustment there. And Kyrie Barrett with the two. 11 6 game. Crystal Ray has their sack 13 fouls. He has yet to commit a foul here in this one. Key, used to the championship pressure. A dry. Shot clock at 18, play a ton, a crossover dribble, the three, and a tip to miss. Pass off for three, Russo fighting for the ball, and Crystal Ray's gonna get it. Going out of bounds here. <laughs> 2.28 left, there in the first quarter. Smith. Smith inside, a lane of bodies, and forces a foul call. In the act of shooting, the senior Tayshawn Smith at the line to shoot two. First shot spinned out. Top here above in the bleacher area. Thank the MIA and the Hartford and the college community by helping and setting in the second shot going here for Smith. Got it. 11 7 game up to the four point advantage for the Zags. Swings it. That's a jumper. Oh, man. For Noah Parker. And Parker drops that one in. It's a 13 7 affair. Smith. Back over. Long range for Barnett there. That's a jumper. More better. That one tipped and miss. Here comes Key. Back over. Fast break. And a foul is called. 
Foul against Crystal Ray. That's their 15th foul. Jenkins at the line shooting up here. And this is some point lead, 14 to 7. Again, the press defense by Key. Go, go. Factor. Back over, swings it. Inside. A nice pass work. Barnett finishes it. 14 to 9 affair. Back over. Nice snatch. He stepped out. Stepped out. As he took the ball, the foot was right on the baseline. And Key catches a break there and gets the ball back. 106 here left in the first. Yeah, man. Jenkins. Brings it back over. Double, Jenkins at the top. And the ball kick is going to stay with Key. And shot clock at 20, game clock at 50.9. Backcourt violation. Glenn was saying he's trying to establish himself. But got caught. And on for Sarah. Put them together, Sean. Come down. Barnett looking to inbound. Swings it over to Lee. Lee says coming out from JV has played great dividends here for Crystal Ray. Side. Whoa, that was a hard fight. That was a hard one on the deck. The two shots coming up and you get key within three if he gets both. Only a second team foul against his ex. Sunday afternoon. First shot, spin out. Spin out. Second shot here. Got to get it within four. It got one of two. 14 to 10 are fair. Double team. That's a three. Hits it! Shot clock is off. Key's biggest lead. Back at seven. Lee. Showing everything. Back over. And got it in as a senior. Kristen. Eight, seven. That's a three in the corner. Spent out. On part of offensive rebound. Nice adjustment. Two, one. Got to put it up. Good night. And that's the end of the first. And after one in the C Conference Championship game, Key, the two time defending champion, up five over the top seeded Crystal Ray. 12 17. Thank you for joining us here on the Live Story Network. Check us out on our social media, the Twitter and Instagram, Dive Story Net. Go to our official Facebook page now, Dive Story Network, and of course, right here on our YouTube page. Subscribe now to the Dive Story Network. Right here, it is your home to the best sports action in the Baltimore metro area. We've covered quite a bit of great high school action this year alone here on DSM, and I'll tell you, Second quarter it will be interesting as we take you back to game action here. Second quarter about to get going. Crystal Ray's going to get the ball. They are down by five. Definitely is not the same from the first two meetings. I see two teams again due to the weather. 
in makeup games. This is the third time they've seen each other in pretty much a week. Met each other last Friday, and then on Tuesday, inside! Smith couldn't finish an offensive rebound. In case you did that, he couldn't get it. Smith got it back, inside. Smith trying to get it out, no good. Smith gets another chance. He's coming up to see the pair. Tyson Smith, the senior. to four, 17 to 13. It's key. Showing championship middle wide open and a two goes in. Wide open there. Back the other way. Smith. Trying to push the tempo. Smith, another chance. Inside and a lot of traffic. A tie up. A jump ball. Let's see which way it's gonna go. Not sure. Look like he's gonna get it. And Key is going to go. So I'm going to take a brief rest. 19 13 affair. Six point lead here for the two time C Conference champion. Key. Key score. Face it, back over. That's a three, and that rainbow. That comes Crystal Ray, trying to cut in his lead. Curry, drives all the way in, and gets it in. Curry Curry, the senior, dropping it home. It's a 19-15 game. Side bumper, and that's a foul against Crystal Ray. That's the 15th foul against the Hornets. First shot in there. Shot goes two. Lead back to six, 21 15. Off the screen. Inside, Kitty. Yep, Curry. Barnett. Inside. Offensive foul. Greg Conway coming in. 6.23 they left in the first half. The C Conference Championship game. It's a drive. No good. Balls on the deck, he hustled to get the offensive board. Spin move. A little kiss. No, didn't go for Jenkins. Ball. Looked like it would go back to Crystal Ray. Right, 55 here left in the uh, first half still. Up over Curry, couldn't finish it. Barnett. 
And the foul is called. 14 foul against two. First shot here for Burnett. In there. Little pop bubble action. Second shot here. In there. Shots are good, 21-17. Try, off his feet, under his legs, turn over. And Crystal Ray gets it back. I've not been able to break the four point mark for them so far. Definitely a different matchup than the first two, which Crystal Ray dominated both. The convincing wins. Curry. Try. Pull up jumper. Yes, sir. Two point game. 21 and 19. Back over. Tans. Fuso. Missed it. Offensive rebound, no. Tied with a two. Curry all the way, blocked from behind by Tance. Tance with unbelievable ball control. And a foul. 17 foul against Crystal Ray. And that equals the one and one. In this case, we'll equal two shots as well. Because it was in the accuracy. First shot. Hits it. Here's the lead back to three. We are close to the halfway mark here. In the second quarter. Second shot here. Got it. Timeout by Key. 434 here left in the first half. It's a 23 to 19 game here for Key. Trying to get that three peak. Trying to get that three peak in a row and fourth overall. Keys, who also won the Sea Conference Championship back in 2008. 24 years of the MIAA. The 25th game will be next season. What a game. We have witnessed here today. Be out the timeout. Inside and they walk. The turnover as the ball goes back to key. And a turnover. Or was it? He's going to catch a break and keep it. 
Yangtze almost. That was John Allen almost had a steal. Back inside. Double team. Jump ball. Just the way we'll get it. No, it's going to stay with Keith. Referees getting together. I've seen one point Crystal Way waiting, and I've seen two from Key Way. They're going to keep it with Key. Shot clock be at 12, game clock be at 4 or 1. Swings it back over. Russo, look quiet in the second. Way downtown there for Tance. Out of bounds. Crystal Way will get it. Hudson Smith tried to get it, and it went out of bounds on him. One of, one of the sophomores. And so far, we've seen all three sophomores in this game so far. Some huge experience in this one today. That's a three from Allman. That one breaks off the back. No good. Back over. Offensive foul. A charge. Double team Curry. Curry got it back. Swings it over again. That jumper. That one tipped and missed. Rebound to Jenkins. Nice catch there. Tucked over his line, but able to hold it. And then Crystal Ray turns it right back over. Posada turns it over, and Key again catches a break. And they get the ball back. Irving inbounds it over to Glenn. And swings it back to Jenkins. To drive and one. Jenkins lead back to seven again for Key. And Curry with it back over to Posada. That was a high pass for Furl. Posada got to get it out of that zone. Almost had it ten seconds. Side the layup goes. The sophomore Furl got it back in there. At a five-point game now. 2.44 left in the half. Pull up jump. Tipped and miss. Offensive rebound. Brings it back. Working the clock now. Let's keep. Foul is called. 19 foul. It's going to be one and one still. First shot's in there. 27 21. No good. Out of bounds. 
And the ball goes to Crystal Lane. Over. Got a lane. Got the layup. There's Conway with the two. Four point game. Crystal Ray once. And the 15 foul. Call the two now. Crystal Ray got it within two. Early in, in this quarter, we have a man to get over the house. On it and over to. First shot though. Second shot. And there. 2 11 here left in the half. Six point game, 29 23. Foul is called. It's only the 16th foul against uh, Key. And the inbound is Curry. Smith, spin move. Couldn't get it. He's about to Jenkins. 145 left in the half. Double team. That's a three. That missed there from Grime. Offensive rebound. And what positioning that was. That two goes in. It's an eight point lead now. 31 23. That's a three. That one did not go. Rebound back over to Irving. Got space in there from Crystal Ray. And two shots on this end of the court. His ass coming up. Second shot in there. Ten point lead, biggest lead. For Key. Inside, that didn't go. Over the Zags. Fast break time. We're down to seconds in the half. Stolen away. Curry. Going coast to coast. Block! Back to Jenkins. The key. Pull up. Missed it. Offensive rebound. Foul is called. Dry Johnson coming up to the line to shoot you. First shot. Got it. Second shot in there. One thing about this key team, when they get to the line, they're hitting them free throws. Smith. Four men in the lane. And a foul. It's going to be shitting too. First 
shot in there. Second shot, try to get the lead back to Chen. Dust. Shot clock is off, it's right at 32 seconds. Eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. And side Jenkins off the glass in it. Uh, the team trying to three peak. For the first half, so far, so good. And at halftime, he is up. 37 to 25. Back from the second half of this one. The other night's when they got to stick and stay. Right here. 24th in my AAC conference championship game. Second half of this C Conference Championship game about to get underway. Crystal Raider top seed down by 12. And they are in a spot they haven't been in too much this year. At least in, in C Conference play. And that is playing from behind. 12 and 0. It's Crystal Ray, by the way, in C Conference play in the regular season this year. Curry almost got stripped. He pulls up this time. No good. Offensive rebound. Ah, oh, did not go. Side. Layup goes. Irving. 39 25. Swings it, Curry, looking to shoot. That's a three, spin out. There on Barnett, offensive rebound, Smith. Three five. A traveling call. Key right now, two time defending. She called for Chantling, trying to make it three. That's a three. Side Smith got the bowl. Got the bowl there. And he cut back down to 12. That's a three. It's it. Russo didn't hit Lockerman in the second, but he just hit in the third. That big three. Fifteen point lead. Side. That one didn't go. Now back over to the Zag. Hands all the way to the basket and gets it in. This is trying to slip away from the top seed, Crystal Ray. Pull up. Missed it high, offensive rebound. Grenenza, no good. He gets it back again. Trying to go in with it. Spin move. Barnett got it. Right, excuse me. Got that too. Oh boy. Jenkins pulls up. Tried to save it, but Curry got it there for Chris away. Menenza, no good. That's a rebound. Got it in there. Who's <laughs> buckets for the Hornets? Keep a minute. Jenkins. Brings it back over inside the layup goes in there for them. 46 31. Okay, On the floor. Put 
puts it up off the glass and in. Right now, though, he can't get in a, in a scoring match. With Key, that's a three. That one tipped and missed. Rebound back over to Crystal Ray. Oh, Austin. Burrow was looking to pass it. Beninza was able to get it. He gets it back. Very quickly paced third quarter here. Curry with it. Right now, points are needed. That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Rebound over to Jenkins. Swings it back. Fur on the deck. Lock and foul against Crystal Ray. First team foul on either side. Here in the court. Back over. Friends over to guys spend out. Ball's gonna go to Crystal Ray. Foul against Key. Inside. Right. Two shots coming up. Here for Yankee. Second team foul on Key. First shot, no good. And shot is in. One of two. That's a three. Never missed. Trying to grab. Second team foul. Third team foul to the Gisky. Drive. Wow. Got the ball, offensive rebound against the guy to win. Ball point game now. That's just the way. Jenkins, keeping the dribble. Timeout by DeVay. 227 left here in the board. 12 point lead. At one point, DeVay has got it to a 16 point lead.
to game action. Trying to get a steal. Inside! Couldn't elevate. Drive! Two shots coming. First shot, no good. Second shot here. Missed it. Jenkins with it. Getting harassed by Yancey and a foul of call. Second team foul in this Together, see which way he's gonna go here. He's gonna go Key's way. Spin move, pull up. Get the miss. Offensive rebound. Get your back up, no good. Third chance. Off the glass, no good. This time a foul of Getsky. That's the 16th foul. So Curry brings it back up as the third quarter wanes here into the fourth. 114. That's a high pass. That's a three to really cut into this lead. It does! Now it's a single digit game. It's a nine point game. Right it! He able to keep possession. Turns it over. Kerr swings it over to Curry. Curry pass. Got it one. And a touch in it. Fist away. Hornets back in it. 48-41 with 37 points. Seven left in the quarter. Now you get what you want. Now you get what you want. <laughs> Second. Ashley. Oh, got it. Oh, first the rebound off the glass. And now he's back at the line. This time to shoot two. 17 foul against Keith. <laughs> 
First shot in there. Second shot to cut the lead to five. Ah, didn't go. Back over to Fuso. On the floor again, jump ball. Come out. By Crystal Ray to keep possession. 31.4 left. Hughes. And the third quarter event at turn Hughes. For a quick turn out. Money made quick 30 second. My, my. Just never know in a game of basketball, folks. There is nothing safe. And then this one. The top city Crystal Ray has fought back. It was played within six. 48, 42. 31.4 seconds away. Back to game. Inside, no bounce, offensive rebound, blocked away. Back comes Tance, all the way to the basket, no left. Hey, leading the break. Coast to coast, missed it. Third chance, couldn't go. Irving, the title. Ball back to push away with one, 11.1 left. First quarter that was that the first five minutes of it was going smoother than and buttercream and now all of a sudden the last three minutes of it has been amazing. Curry swings it over. That's a three. It's in the corner. Allen drops it in. Lee that dropped that three in. And after three, in this big conference game of the NIA, here in Maryland, it's 48 45. Key clinging to a three point lead here. Coming up next on the Dodge Learning Network, it's Gerstel Academy. We got Gerstel several times early in the season this year. They're the defending B Conference champions, but they're not the top seeded team. St. Paul is. They beat Amagos Tell, meeting up. St. Paul's won both of the regular season meetings this year. The third time, hopefully, is a charm for Gustav, and they can repeat as B Conference champions. That game's coming up when we die turning up with two stick of stay. Right here. For the fourth quarter of this one. Looming launch is key. Only scoring 11 points in the quarter. Crystal Ray has put up 20 in the third. In the fourth quarter. <coughs> Not to get underway. Lee got it from Yancey. Lee inbound. <coughs> Back over. Drive inside! One point game! Good! A sophomore! Dropping it. The last five points coming from the sophomore. As Lee almost got a steal there. Bounced out. Russo, one point game. Crystal Ray trying to get that first seat coffee tension. Tance. Looking to inbound to Jenkins. And got it in there to him. Yes. I 
that's the 14 foul against Crystal Ray here in the half. I miss. Defensive rebound doubled. Got it somehow. Here comes Lee. Curry. Curry on the baseline. He's shooting two. Curry, Curry the senior. Shooting a pimp. First shot. No good. Second shot here. No good. Curry. That's them both at the line. Jenkins. Turns it over. Back comes Crystal Ray. Curry for the tie. No good. Tried to save it. Does. Yancey with it. Yancey is fouled. 19 foul against King. No good. I go over to Russo. Foul call. 15 foul uh, against Crystal. <laughs> Irving looking to inbound. Over to Jenkins. 6.30 left in this one. Seat Conference Championship game. Early in my head. Drive. Offensive foul. Temp team foul now in his team. Five better Hughes, but now just wait to get to the line. They'll be shooting two. The rest of the way. Brings it back. That's the three for Lee. Hits it with quite a 50. The sophomore proving dividends here in this one. Almost picked. Layup is good. And Irving gets the bag to lead back by two. 52 50. Here in the APG Federal Credit Union Arena. Inside. Power game again. It's Curry. Actually, that was Stern Howley with the two. Jenkins. He trying to three peak. Twist away the top seed trying to get number one for the first time ever. Out of bounds! And it's going back to the Hornets. Yeah. Hornets get it back. We got a timeout by Crystal Ray. We are dead even. 5 11 left in this game. Tied up 52. What a game. And the championship matches we've seen so far on DSN has been treats indeed. IAM last week. On a 
Kansas City Championship a couple days ago. And this one today. We're hoping all three will be treats. Tied at 52, 5-11 left in it. Triple out of day for my office action. And Curry with it. Crystal Ray trying to get the lead for the first time in this one. Curry drives, pulls off, and takes the lead. And a sit down jumper. <laughs> Crystal Ray up 54 52. Floater, tie game. No product. Ties it at 54. Curry, right. Lee, the sophomore. Lee inside, Mr. Reposo. Second set goes. One sophomore to another for Gets Chris away to lead back by two. Jenkins is in the halfway point of the fourth. Jenkins pulls up. Tipped and miss. That comes for Chris away. All the way. Didn't go. Offensive rebound. Oh. Turn over! Back to the horse! And a huge turn of events there in the second half. Four point lead, 345 left. Over. Same time on the shot clock. That's the three. Tipped and missed. Offensive rebound to Curry. Curry puts it up. Block. And Jenkins gets it back over to Tan. That's the three. That one tipped and missed. Out of bounds going back to Crystal Ray. Company brings it up. 310 left. Smith. And Sarah got it in! And Singer gives the Hornets a six point lead. 60 to 54. Foul is called. 16 foul. Against the Hornets. Irving inbounds back out. Back over to Johnson. Jenkins. Got the space. Off! Oh, no. They don't call him charge. 17 foul against Pistol Ray. That's the one and one. And in fact, for the Zags.
through. That one didn't go. Rebound to Kerr. Back over to Lee. Lee kicks it. That's a three. It's a double by Butters. Brad Burke might have hit a dagger. Time out by Key. Two twelve left for Crystal Ray to get their first C Conference championship. And they're right in position to do so. Biggest lead for them. Seven. At one point, they were down 16 here to start the third quarter. What a comeback by the top seeded team here in the Sea Conference. Trying to keep that record unblemished. Here to get the championship today. First one of three here on the Dinosaur Network. First towel and St. Paul's to follow. St. Francis, Mount St. Joe's to follow that one. What a game. What a comeback. A key team that early looked poised, had the championship poise as being two-time defending champions. In the second half, got forced. A little bit more physical. Inside, it looked like turned the game around for Crystal Ray. Jenkins at the line. And Jenkins did miss his way. But before then, that's the way it was hitting. Pretty regular. Good shot. No good. Burr. Brings it up. Off the knee. And stick with the horn. Kingston almost turns it over. Yancey to keep it. Shot clock at 15. Game clock at 148. Smith. Smith inside. All the way to the basket. And <laughs> Technical foul. The shot is good. He's going to come up to shoot the technical on this end. I'm going to keep that composure, you crystal. Right at the finish line. Going to be on the bench. Crystal right there. That's a 19 foul against the. Uh, Nice first away. Good shot. In there. Eight point lead. Shot is in there. A foul is called as well. The first one did not go on that. This is the chance. Shot does. 
six point game. You go, you go, you go. 141 left on this one. What a game. What a matchup. Team the TC Conference on. Double team. Two possession for the Zags here. They're going to have any shot at three feet in. They got to get a bucket here. Jumper off the glass and spin down. Six point lead. Both teams over the foul limit. And a double bonus. Curry. Curry pulls up. Missed it. Back over. Ball, jump ball, or foul. See what we got here. It's going to be a foul. And it's pushed away. So it brings Key back down to this head. 104 left. And two shots coming. Bird with the foul ball. Rattles her. Second shot here to get this lead to four. Front end miss. Use rebound defensively there by Crystal. Down the second slot. Smith. Foul. Smith coming up to shoot two. First shot here. Rotation on Smith. Got it. Going lead again. Second shot here. 56-59. We're coming down the stretch. Cross over inside and layup goes. Turn out by a key. Five point game. Full time out by the Zags. Timeout. As I say, and this one is Custis last stand. Here for Key. Okay. The 
whistle. He tries not to foul, at least not yet. 39 seconds. Not to foul shortly. Smith. And he has fouled there. Two shots coming up. Shot is in. Six point lead. Lost it. Yeah, that's it. Foul is called. And now the celebration, I believe, can begin for the Hornets. First shot, no good. No good. Second shot, no good. He go out of bounds. Yancey swings it back to Smith. Two fouled, coming back up. 25.7 left. First shot, in there, in there. Second shot here. Got it. 69, 61. Jenkins down the court. For three, off the mark. I was about to say off key, but hey, that would have run. Key still gets it, 17.2 left. And Key's amazing run at the C Conference. A three-peat, not in the future this year. That's a three. Tipped and missed, batted back. That will do it. Crystal Ray, school about a decade. Will find the first seat of the champions. And that's it. Crystal Ray celebrates DT of Benji Lashley with defeat and winning their first ever C Conference Championship. What an amazing comeback by the Hornets in the second half and beating Kings for a third time in this regular season. Let me say emotions running high. And for the key members, even though they didn't get the W today, the three P. Oh, we celebrate an amazing run. Amazing run by the Zags. They're going to come up against Stewart.
pushed away. Gets it done. And that's second try against the um, for the Sea Coffin Championship. <laughs> Good game, Good but I couldn't take it. Good one. Good one. No question about it. There comes the Sea Conference Championship. What an amazing year for Crystal Ray. They're going to end the season. At 19 and 10, he's going to drop to 12 and 7 as both teams have played their last games of the season. Long journey for Crystal Ray up in Baltimore City, in the heart of it. And the C Conference champions. Here for the 24th time in the MIA will be the top seeded Crystal Ray Joshua's Hornets. A good time to celebrate. Championship. But there's only part one of three for us today. Gush Tell, St. Paul's on the court. They're about to take stage. And the B Conference Championship game goes to trying to repeat. Stick and stay right here on the Dice Lane Network for the MIA B Conference Championship here at Hoffman Community College's APGFC U Arena. We will be back. This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what?